Hey, what's going on, Portal Masters? Robert Walken here from CoinOp TV. Now, on this episode of Skylanders 101, I'm going to break things down with Jawbreaker, a new Skylanders Trap Master tech element for Skylanders Trap Team. He's one of my new favorites, and he will be yours as well. Let's check out some of Jawbreaker's gameplay right now. Down for the count. All right, Portal Masters, let's check out Jawbreaker. I have mine leveled up at level seven here. Tech Element, Trap Master. I got this crazy hat on him. If you get to the end of the game, you get to get that hat as well. Let's go through some of his powers here. Trap Team Team Punch. Robo Rage Mode. So you press the uh, circle to enter Robo Rage. Makes him move a little faster. Kind of reminds me a little bit of Wind Up there. Raging Robo Rage. Spark Shock. Press the triangle to punch the ground and release a wave of sparks. I feel like that's good when water's around to, you know, carry the spark or something. Alternating current. Uh, heavy hands. Trap team punches do even more damage. And then I went with the top path here. Static cling. Spark shocks attack sticks to enemies doing damage over time. Hands off. Sparking interest, can constantly releasing electronic sparks, so you'll see little sparks flying around. Or you guys may opt to go with the bottom path, bottom path here. Jolting jabs, defense firmware update, punch for power, and then his soul gem is the hypercharge haymaker. So you'll hold the triangle to charge up a powerful electronic punch. Okay, let's get to some of the gameplay. I'm right about to get attacked by some enemies, so it's game time. You're about to go down, choppies. So here's the first attack here. You can just kind of bunt mash away with his fists and you'll see my le electronic pulses popping out there let me do the ground pound sort of there we go that shoots out a little smash to the ground you can see you gotta be up close to the villains though for that one so that's the least useful but then if you hold the triangle down ah uh, i'm stuck in the corner there's my haymaker <laughs> let me go over here it's haymaker versus haymaker see look this enemy uh, i already killed him i was gonna say that enemy also has like a haymaker where he can kind of shoot his arm out far there so let me spin it this way there's there's the soul gem it's pretty cool but it takes like a few seconds to kind of charge up Let's see if I can get this dude right here. Boom! In your face! 300 damage! Not bad. I'm just gonna go ahead and spin spin circles around you and let my electronic pulses <laughs> take you guys out and clear that level. So you can see Jawbreaker makes some pretty easy fast work of those chompies and the other uh, villains that were coming out. And I think it just looks cool overall. I can't wait to go pick up the legendary Jawbreaker at Toys R Us and then hopefully I'll make a video with him and this is just cool too when he jumps i like the way his feet pop up there he doesn't have like a ground pound attack per se like wildfire and stuff like some of the figures like snapshot when you jump they just keep doing what they're doing in the air but that kind of looks like almost like a ground pound right there Ooh, got a pretzel nom, 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 nom. all right so there's a quick look at jawbreaker let me know in the comments below if you guys are going to pick jawbreaker up and most of all let me know which path you go with when you're leveling up your jawbreaker. For CoinAppTV, we'll see you Portal Masters next time.